Welcome back to Llama Mama Kayla's Yarn Tube. I'm Kayla, and I thank you for stopping by and visiting with me today. Today is a uh, different type of video. I just wanted to um, share something um, that Patina received, just because I think it's fun, and it was exciting. And also, I want to tell Barbara, thank you very, very much, and let her know how much I appreciate everything that she sent patina so patina got happy mail a christmas gift box and so i just wanted to share that and if you don't know who patina is she is this poodle doll right here this is patina she was made in japan in the year of 1966 actually monday was her birthday and she turned 58 years old okay so patina is usually my most photographed doll i carry her in my purse all almost all the time oh i popped off that i can glue it back on um i carry her in my purse almost all the time and if i see a photo opportunity i snap photos of her and so um my friend Barbara also has a patina and so uh, we are patina friends <laughs> and anyway so she made this dress this awesome amazing dress for patina and this hat it was a Christmas dress and I just popped that off but I can um, always glue it back on I will do that because I love this dress it is just amazing um, she makes clothes for dolls sometimes, or I don't know if she does very much, but she has in the past. And some of the clothes that she dresses her dolls in are just so cool because she's very creative and she can sew. <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to show you Patina's Christmas dress. I'm going to be changing her out of this soon so that she can um, get ready for her birthday party photos. <laughs> so anyway, and if you don't know how silly I am, then you don't follow me on Instagram. <laughs> but anyway, I want to show you, she received a box of things. And so here is a whole box of items that Patina received. And so I just wanted to show real quick, she got this cute little elf. He is so cute and little. So, um, not only did she receive the beautiful dress, she got some cute little items too. So, here is a little elf. And because I had surgery and was so sick, I didn't get to take a lot of Christmas photos. But, it'll come around again. And then also, Barbara made this little doll for Patina. And it's a mermaid doll. Isn't that just fabulous? So, so cute and amazing. I love it. So that's a little doll for Patina. She'll be um, appearing in some photos of Patina. Let's see. And then there's some little pretend cookies for Patina or any other dolls. But they're really cute. And they're made out of, um, I believe, clay. So really, really cute. Um, she also got this little mini-verse make it food bowl ball. And I'm really excited about this. And I know that's like a little gingerbread house, but we're going to do it. Um, I've actually got some balls for Christmas of different... Um, some of the mini brand different things and so I'll be doing those and I might even make videos doing them because I just think they're so fun and let's see what else does she got here she got a um a Vogue magazine how fun is that and it's just some papers um really it's for the front you know to look like Patina's reading a magazine but that's cool props you know and then um, oh she got a little food item 
Let's see here. I've already opened it and know what it is, but I'll show you guys what Patina got. She got a foot long hot dog from Sonic. Oh, Patina's got to have a friend to help her eat that. <laughs> it's not real or anything, but you know, it's cute and it looks like Sonic. So she got a hot dog. And it's in a Hardy's bag. That is just so cute though. Okay. And that's what I told my kids that I wanted for Christmas was um, some of these kind of balls and different things like foodies fashion and the mini verse and so I've got some of those that I'm gonna be opening and doing and Patina got a poodle a pink poodle at that isn't that just pretty she's so pretty and fluffy and the perfect size for a pet for Patina so I love that poodle and there was a little llama in the box. How cute is that? So fun. Let's see. Okay. And then here's a, um, it's a Rainbow High fashion handbag. It's a handbag surprise, so you don't know what's in it, you know, until you open it. It's one of those deals. I've seen these at Target, but I've never bought any. I really wasn't quite sure exactly what they were but um here's a little bag here with some little tags tickets and off the bags things and then this come in this little bag and then you open it to reveal the purse so that's a great purse for patina so cool. So cool and cute. So she'll have that purse and some photos on Instagram. I just love this. So she's put so much, so many thoughtful items. In this box for Patina. Um, and then she, she also sent me this card. I'm not going to read it. But I think it's really cool. Because if you don't know. And I didn't know until I homeschooled my kids. And learned that in Japan. Or Japanese books. Start from the back and go to the front. And so that's the way this card is. Like I think that's the um, back of the card. And then it opens up. So that's the way books are. Japanese books are. And so I had learned that whenever I homeschooled my kids. Because I didn't learn that in regular school. When I was in school. And so um, I just think that's cool. So. And I think it's cool because it's a card. You know done like a Japanese book. Japan. And she was actually made in Japan. And then here's something for like a little prop. It's um supposed to look like a little vintage Barbie house like there is a little vintage Barbie house and some of you might have had something like that that it unfolds and folds out and it's a little house with like cardboard walls and such and so that's what it's supposed to look like it don't really open or anything like that it's just an empty box and it can just set you know in a photo for a photo prop so that's really cool and then some um, stickers, different kinds of stickers. And a couple of these are really cute and not Christmas. And so I'm going to try to take the sticker and apply it on some felt. And maybe put a little bit of stuffing, a little bit of polyfill in between the sticker and the felt. Just to make it look a little puffy. So it's a little pillow type thing, you know, or appears in a photo. So... I'm going to try to do something with some of those little stickers. Just because they are so cute. 
here is a little card um and this is this card was made by another patina collector and this shows some of patina's original outfits i do have the bikini set and the um hat the flip-flops and her armband but i did not have um the, I don't have the glasses that came with her original set. This is what she originally come in. And then they sold extra clothes. Um, now, I don't know if they ever sold a dog for Patina or not. Um, I don't know. But anyway, it's really cute showing those original clothes that could have been purchased for her. And some people do have these original clothes, but it's so cute. Anyway, this was made by Red Pepper Picnic, and she is a patina collector also, and also collects Blythe dolls and other things like that. Here is a, um, a little toy for patina. It probably came in one of those, um, mini brand, mini brand toy balls. And so it's a um, alien from one of the Toy Story movies. How well you can see that. And actually, I recently was given a uh, bigger alien doll. And so that'll be cute together. So that is just so adorable too. Um, here is some chocolates that was in the box. And I have been waiting, putting off eating these because... Um, I wanted to, you know, do this little video to show what all came in the Patina's Christmas box. And um, I'll be able to eat those because they'll just melt in my hot mouth. <laughs> and here is a, another handbag. It's a Rainbow High handbag for Patina. And it is a beautiful pink purse. Isn't that cute? And it does open up. It's Velcroed. And on the inside is some little tickets. I can't even read what that says. Even with my glasses on. But anyway, the handbag is so cute. And it's going to just be adorable in photos with Patina. I've been slacking on making photos, taking photos and such. Because, you know, I had surgery and I was sick and just had things going on. But, um, and now it's just so cold. I hadn't been going anywhere. <laughs> I hadn't been going anywhere doing anything. But, um, okay. Um, I got a phone call and I wasn't sure exactly where the video cut off at, but I think I was showing this purse this pink purse that's so darling i think i was showing that last but anyway so i'm back um isn't that a lot of stuff in patina's box and then she got this little accessory package um with a little cell phone patina needed a cell phone and a camera and balloon a sun visor a fanny pack bracelet and some boots. I don't know if she'll be able to wear the boots or not. Um, her feet are flat. And that does, does look like flat boots. But Patina's feet are flat. And she can wear like Ken size shoes. Like these boots she has on are Ken size. So those might be a little bit too small for her. But any of my other Barbies and such can wear them. So they will be used. But anyway, there's some sunglasses in there. So, so cute. Lots of little accessories. Now I can open that and use those items. Um, here's a couple of pens that was in here. So cute. And like I said, I missed out on taking Christmas photos. But you know, it'll come around again. And next year, I'll be prepared. <laughs> and then she got one more item in here. Um, and it is a Barbie pack of clothes. That is a dress. And then that is a, um, a dress, too, I'm pretty sure. Um, and then there's a purse in there. 
and again patina won't be able to wear those shoes but a barbie doll will be able to so they will be used and i love the bright colors of this dress and that dress looks very pretty too so she'll have some new dresses for some new photos so exciting so anyway thank you barbara for patina's christmas box like you just blew me away with that it was just above and beyond so much such cute adorable stuff and i love cute stuff so and that's why i like patina so much because she is so cute <laughs> she is and so i know some people probably think that's really weird but it's okay you know me the weirder the better if it ain't weird i don't like it and i love her <laughs> So she got some little friends, um, a little doll there, and then a little doll here, a dog, and a llama. So she got some new friends and some new accessories, and so I will be having lots of fun with photos. And like I said, Monday was actually Patina's birthday, and so we'll be doing birthday photos. I actually ordered her a cake from the bakery. She and um that will i've already picked that up i have it in the fridge it's a little bitty tiny cake <laughs> and so um that will be those photos will be coming up soon as soon as i get my life together <laughs> that's a joke okay because <laughs> that's never gonna happen <laughs> oh anyway um today <laughs> like something new happens every day okay um, today, I uh, woke up and I looked at my phone. I had a text from my neighbor and she asked me, did we have water? And so I texted her back and said, honestly, I don't know. I haven't been out of the bed because it's just too cold to get up right now because it got down to like 10 degrees. I believe this morning at 7 o'clock it was 10 degrees. And so... Um, then uh, I waited until Phoebe woke up and wanted to get up because I knew, you know, she would have to go potty. So I waited till then. And then, hi, Phoebe. And so I got up and I heard water running, but, but there was no water coming out of faucets. So I called my neighbor and said, hey, is there anybody at your house that could come shut my water off? And so she ended up coming and turning the water off. And um, then that took care of the running water <laughs> issue. <laughs> and then um, I called Jody and talked to him. So he was going to Lowe's to get pipes and glue and tape, plumbing tape and glue and all that kind of stuff. So... Um, then my neighbor's husband came down to look at it and see what was going on. He found the pipe and went ahead and cut it and was waiting on Big Daddy to get home from Lowe's. And when he got home, he was able to just cut the pipe and change it out. And so it really worked out well. And we was really, really appreciative to him for doing that because, um, you know, he didn't have to do it. But Elijah has always done our plumbing, and he's been doing our plumbing since he was a very young teenager, like 14 or so. And so, because um, he's the one that is small, and because he's the one that's small and can get under the house and stuff, right? So anyway, um, thankfully, my neighbor's husband came down and helped. And got that done. Oh, Patina did get one more thing for Christmas. I'm going to leave this here so I can glue that back on there. Um, Patina got a dress from my neighbor for Christmas. And it is a beautiful dress. Look at this. Patina got a blue dress. It's a long blue dress. With a little flower on it right there. And it's a sleeveless dress. It's kind of stretchy. So it would just stretch up over her. 
she has wide hips. Like, most Barbie clothes will work for her, except pants are too long. They have to be cut off. Um, skinny Barbie clothes don't fit her because her hips are too wide. But shirts, skirts, and stuff like that, they do fit her. And so, um, this dress is real stretchy, so it fits her. She got a dress and then a purse with a uh, pearl bead handle and then she got some pearls <laughs> she's gonna be all fancy and that will show up good because it's a sleeve um yeah no sleeves or anything at the top so anyway so my neighbor got patina that for christmas <laughs> isn't that funny i just love it i love it so anyway guys I just wanted to make this video, you know, mainly for Barbara to tell her thank you and I appreciate Patina's box so much. Everything in there is just wonderful and I love it all. So guys, I'm going to let you all get going. I hope you're having a good day and I hope that you're staying warm. And if you're somewhere where it is already warm, I hope you're staying cool. <laughs> I'm trying to stay warm. <laughs> Bye, friends. I'll see you all in the next video.